is it really august already and i'm packing to go back to drill for the united states army reserve <laughs> what i have my bag for drill unfortunately i can't believe that i am packing to go back to drill this weekend i'm trying to get this done now so let me do a little rundown real quick for those of you that don't know i'm mariah i'm 23 years old i'm in the united states army reserves my mos is 92 fox which means i'm a petroleum supply specialist now i know what you're thinking what the heck is that it's really not that important i mean it is important okay let me not downplay it i provide people in my unit with petroleum aka fuel aka oil aka lubricants <laughs> but yeah that's my mos in the reserve just a little update for people that are new to my channel i do have a whole army playlist where i document everything about the military from my perspective i am not a military professional and i am not a recruiter i just get on here and talk about the military but anyways i just got back from a deployment in march it's now august 1st and this weekend we have our first drill. With that being said, I need to go ahead and pack my bag so I'm ready to go for the weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Now the gag is that I threw all my stuff from deployment underneath my bed. Let me show you guys. It's actually kind of embarrassing. I was just so fed up. At the end of my deployment, I did not organize anything. But my last day in Texas, Fort Bliss, where I was for out processing or demobilization, I washed all my military clothes. So everything's clean, it's just not organized. Ooh. Okay. Sorry. Gotcha. So I don't know what's in what. It's looking like everything is in this duffel bag. Cause there's nothing in this double bag. Let's see what we have here. Basically, I do three underwears, three sports bras, one to two pairs of socks, one to two pairs of socks, PT sneakers, PT, PT. Let me just show y'all how I prepare. Oh, I, I forgot about the uniform. I don't even know. Yeah, everything's clean. Let me make sure I got everything. Did I tell you I got promoted to E4, finally? I have my uniform blouse. I hope I can still fit this uniform. I'm gonna need this. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I do not pack more than one uniform because think about it. I wear it all day Saturday and I wear it for Sunday. And then we go home on Sunday. Please. Let me make sure these don't have the holes in them. I have a pair of uniform pants from basic training when we were crawling in rocks because my drill sergeants are ruthless. And it ripped the whole big pair. It ripped a big hole in my pants. I'm gonna need PT. Uniform, short sleeve, this is long sleeve, so that's not gonna work. Here's a long sleeve. Y'all, I have gained so much weight. When I was in Poland, I was 165. Don't ask me how much I weigh now. And I'm pretty sure we have a PT test on Saturday. I've been working out, but not really. Okay, maybe it is organized. I underestimated myself. This is a walk in the park. Oh yeah, of course I wear more than one Coyote t-shirt. I'm not going to recycle this on the weekend. But the uniform itself, the blouse and the pants, I just bring one. But I'm going to bring two of those. Dirty clothes bag, of course. PT bottoms. Mmm. I'm pretty sure we're not wearing winters, but I still like to bring it just in case. Maybe I'm walking around the hotel and I don't 
want to wear pajamas in my hotel i can just wear these because my drill unit is about an hour 30 an hour 45 50 minutes away from me and if you're in the reserves and you live past a certain mileage i guess they put you in lodging which is hotels or barracks or whatever they decide to put you in for the weekend i hope that makes sense so i got my uniform socks pt clothes i'm not gonna use this because it's not cold outside y'all know what i don't have my patrol cap i have no idea where that's at and that's gonna be a problem now i'm bringing this just in case they have me driving a humvee or some type of military vehicle you're supposed to have that on your ach But the gag is, I don't know where my patrol cap is. PT uniform. Uniform. Laundry bag. Socks. So my battle buddy, Danny, has my belt, my uniform belt. She was supposed to bring it to me this weekend. These are the... These have just been through it. Look, look at that crease. And my boot blousers are in here. If you guys don't know what boot blousers are, they basically keep, if you're tall like me, they keep your pants from unrolling out of your boots. So invest in these. And obviously they're very small. And I don't lose things like that, but when I do whatever to stop me from losing these, every time I take off my uniform, I just, throw them in my boots just put them in your boots and they'll be ready for when you are putting your boots on the next day so now that i've done this whole shebang it's looking like i might have to go to fort jackson or u.s patriot to purchase a new patrol cap all right let's do a quick rundown and i'm gonna see if i can show y'all how i put everything into my book bag for the weekend just so y'all have everything so we make sure you guys have everything for drill laundry bag two coyote tops saturday sunday uniform for the weekend need to text danny about i need to text danny about my pt belt wow my hands are very ashy uniform socks i like to bring my winter pts to walk around in if I feel like it. If not, I'm wearing my pajamas. PT bottoms, PT top, ACH in case driving military vehicle, and I also need black socks. I'm gonna write this in my notes because I will forget. All right, I put everything, I typed what I need in my phone so I can get that sometime this week. I'm so glad I'm doing this a week before. I brought out some underwear and sports bras, and ladies, let's talk about it. Invest in some boy short underwear so you're not getting wedgies and Victoria's Secret panties while you're in your uniform. Because today is Sunday, I didn't pack any toiletries. But we're going to see how I can get everything to fit nice and neat. And usually, I just, I'm going to show y'all how I do this, how it works for me. Sometimes I roll my clothes, sometimes I don't. It just depends on how I feel. And I guess it looks like I'm rolling my clothes right now. I'm a very messy roller because I just don't have the time. I know it would be a miracle if we didn't have to take a PT test. But I'm pretty sure we're going to have to. So I just tend to get my mind right just in case. But I haven't heard anything. That don't mean nothing though. If you're in the military, you know. The military does what the heck they want. Wow, I missed the sports bra. I honestly should have put left this at the top. I'm gonna have what I need the most at the top, and then what I need the least at the bottom. Now you don't have to pack everything into one book bag. It's just something I like to do because I don't like carrying too much. And then I carry my book bag for schoolwork because at the end of the duty day. I like to do homework or I'm just hanging out with my battle buddies. Socks. Hmm. 
uniform pants. Y'all, all of this is going into my bag. Uniform top. And then my Coyote t-shirts. And I low-key still have room to put my PT sneakers, my black socks, and a patrol cap. But if you think about it, I'm going to be wearing this uniform. So there's still going to be more space for toiletries. And we still have this big opening. Let me show y'all. So y'all can see, like, there's still so much space in this book bag for toiletries. Um, toothbrush, toothpaste, body wash, all that good stuff. Towel will probably go on my school book bag. In real life, I really take two book bags with me to drill. My school book bag, my military book bag. And, oh my gosh. You know what, what we're forgetting? Pajamas. Let's get some pajamas. A t-shirt. And, what do you know? What does this say? Become Unlimited, United States Army. So that's one t-shirt. I'm only spending the night one time. Hello. Then I'll wear these. Bedtime. And I always pack extra underwear because you just never know. We're basically done packing. Like I said, I still need socks. I need to find my patrol cap or go get a new patrol cap. And I need to pack my toiletries. Now, because obviously this can't fit in a bag, I typically just take the this and I put it on the hook of the book bag like this. I snap it and I just wear it on my bag. Most of the time I leave this in my car and if they say I need it then I can be like okay well let me go to my car but yeah that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the post notification bells because the video after this will be a vlog of me actually going to drill. Um, I'm going to vlog as much as possible. You know, like my other vlogs, like just vlogging my daily life. So stay tuned for that. Love you guys. We're on the road to 10,000 subscribers. So if so, if you're not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and help support Mariah Perry. See you guys in my next video. Girl, that's Jehovah. Shady got her own, she don't play that. Shady being it, she don't play 10. Pretty in the face and a way snatch.